Welcome back to episode 11 of Hawks. Last episode we did Red Eagle and we defended Washington from an attack by Artemis and now we've got this mission, Torchlight. Artemis has launched a massive surprise attack on the United States, beginning with a lightning assault on the capital itself. Thanks to the heroic efforts of a handful of defenders, me, <laughs> Washington remains in US hands, but the situation is desperate. All, all fighters, okay here we go, this is it, this is the big fight. All fighters. And of course, the eagle. Yep, it's got to be the eagle. And it's got radar guided missiles. Not what I would have chosen if it was me. I'd have chosen multi, uh, the multi missile, but radar guided is good for attacking a range. Really good for that. I'm really liking my noise gate settings right now. They're really good. Major Wallace, this is Hawk's flight. We are at the indicated nav point and awaiting further orders. You should be detecting a U.S. military jet approaching your position low and from the south. That's your rendezvous. Hawks lead, I've got tally on the... Oh, man. Is that what I think it is? Affirmative, Hawks. That's Air Force One. The President and his family are on board, as well as his senior cabinet officials. We're evacuating them from the Capitol to keep them out of Artemis's hands. Your mission is to escort Air Force One out of harm's way and accompany it to a secret location. Code named November 4. The president and his staff will be safe there while we try to get a handle on what's happened. Understood, sir. You can count on us. We'll get them to November 4. See that you do, Hawks. A lot of good men died to make this evacuation possible. I don't want their sacrifice to be in vain. Hawks Light, this is Eagle. Man, am I glad to see you guys. Stay close. I'm altering course and heading for November 4 now. No worries, Eagle. We've got you covered. Nobody's getting through us. Here we go, big mission, defending the president himself. What's that, three friendlies? Hawks flight, this is Citadel. Be advised, you have multiple bandits inbound, bearing one, eight, zero, and moving fast. They look like they mean business. Hawks flight copies. Okay, guys, let's get to business. Right behind you, Casper. Come on, surely I'm in range. Fifteen... Really? Still not? Fox flight. The circle surrounding each enemy on your attack map indicates their effective weapons range. Keep Eagle out of those circles by shooting down the bandits or entering the circles yourself to force the bandits to engage you. Understood? We can get it, Citadel. Take out the bandits or get inside those circles and force the bad guys to engage us instead. You got it. Now get busy. Those bandits look hungry. Let's get in their faces, Hawks Flight! Yep. Engaging now! Straight away, you guys go and attack. Bandits vectoring on your position. Bearing 060. Call out. Copy that, Control. Tally on the bandits! Right, go do some magic while I try and get in range with the guided missiles. Although I'm pretty sure they're going to get in range of Air Force One before I get in range of them. Target? This is Eagle. We're almost inside the bandit's targeting circle. Take that guy out fast or he'll break off and go after us. Missile launched. Ox flight, this is Eagle. We've got bandits closing on us fast. Where are you guys? They must not achieve interception, Hawks lead. Hit them with everything you've got. Stay sharp, guys. We can't let any of these gomers pass us. They're coming in Target fast lead. this time. Casper, well. take that guy out. Watch it, Casper. You've got a bandit on your tail. Five o'clock, low. Damn it, they've got me boxed in. Crenshaw, stay on Eagle. I can't cover them. Look down, Casper. There's two more. Zero, oh, yo, 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 yo. Oh, oh, that was so close. Right, who's closer? I'll go with these guys. Enemy plane shot down. And that had to Watch your tack map, Hawks Flight. Bandits are closing in on Eagle. Uh, I knew I sh This is Eagle. I'm in big trouble over here. Where are you guys? You've got a lock, Flight Leader. Fire it well. Step it up, guys. Fox We're getting lead. too close Confirm. to Eagle. Shut that guy down, Casper. He's almost in fire. Hawks lead. Hawks lead. I need help fast. Hawks Flight, I've got multiple interceptors lining up for a shot on Eagle. They're about to close the trap. We copy, Citadel. Rolling in now. Oh, Eagle did take a hat. That's one last bandit to worry about. Good shot, Flight Leader. He's still okay, though. 
83%. This is Eagle. We're almost inside the bandit's targeting circle. Take that guy out fast or he'll break off and go after us. That's another flight of bandits taken out. Good work, Hawks. Bandit flight destroyed. Reform on Eagle. Oh, where are they going to come from next? Bandits are closing on multiple vectors. We're getting boxed in. Hold your water, Eagle. We're on it. Keep Eagle out of the enemy engagement circle shown on your attack map. Shoot down any bandit that gets too close. Or enter the circle and give him something else to work That's about. doable. That's doable. Totally doable. Oh man, the range on this isn't as good as I thought. Look at this. I'm nearly about 14,000. It's about, yeah, about 11,000 meters. Guys, these gomers know what they're doing. I hear you. I can't get a lock on this guy no matter what I do. Crenshaw, you want to lend us a hand here? I have literally taken down every single bandit so far. Eh? Did I fire? Weapon away. Weapon lock. Is Major Wallace still on this channel? The president wants to speak with him. Go for Wallace. Major, Major I need down. all the information you've got. What's happening? Mr. President, we're still trying to work that out. The situation is very fluid and we're getting a lot of conflicting reports. Well, what do you know? Well, sir, we know that Artemis has launched a massive coordinated attack on the United States. We believe they have hit major military and civilian centers all along the East Coast. Somehow Artemis forces managed to disable our SLAM's anti-missile shield. Our communications and reconnaissance satellites are disabled as well. At this point, we have no idea how large the Artemis attack is, or how much damage they've Enemy inflicted, dead ahead. but we have to assume it's severe. Mr. President, the United States is at war. At this point, I recommend we place our military forces on DEFCON 1. I understand, Major, but at this point, I'm concerned about our nuclear cap- This is Eagle! I may have control. a problem Check with my comms. Hawks Flight, do you read? Eagle, this is Casper. It's not just you. There's some kind of weird interference. Good afternoon, Mr. President. My name is Adrian DeWinter, Chief Executive Officer of Artemis Global Security. In the interest of both your nation and, and my company, shot down. I call upon you to order your military to stand down immediately, and no one else will have to die. Mr. DeWinter, and the United States does not negotiate with terrorists. Even ones in tailored suits. Terrorist? You and I both know that's not true. I'm a businessman, Mr. President. It just so happens that my commodity is warfare. I've made this company into a world-class organization, and you have no right to interfere with that. I what beg you to see reason, Mr. President. Your military is outgunned and outclassed. In just 24 firing. hours, we have managed to knock out your satellite and early warning systems and launch damaging attacks against your civilian no, and industrial centers. Hit, Captain, hit For again. the good of your country, I ask you to put a stop to this violence at once. Because believe me, we're just getting started. Until you're ready to surrender yourself to U.S. authorities, Mr. De Winter, you and I have nothing to talk about. Then I assure you, Mr. President, if you won't talk to me, I'll make sure you won't talk to anyone else, either. Yep, RMS is going full empire. They've gone full bad guy. What the hell? My ERS is malfunctioning. Oh, no more missiles. Nope, still missiles. All U.S. aircraft, be advised. We're getting high power jamming across all frequencies. Source unknown. Whatever it is, it's also affecting our data links, so your ERS and targeting systems are going to be affected. Hawks Flight, heads up. We were showing more bandits heading your way before the jamming started. They could be on top of you at any time. Here we go. Some fun little jamming. Hawks I wonder. Flight, you're 50 miles from November 4. You're in the home stretch now. Oh, yep, they do. Right now, still can I still use my you're radar guided? On your ERS. It won't work while you're being jammed. Because of the jamming, it's going to take longer to get a radar lock. You'll also lose radar lock very quickly, so when you get a lock, shoot fast. I wonder if this will still work, though. Good launch. Tracking it now. Nope. Right, guided missiles don't work anymore. Fox, this is Eagle. I'm turning on to final approach. Keep those guys off us for just a few more minutes, all right? Copy that, Eagle. We just concentrate on getting that bird safely on the ground. Leave the rest to us. Launch 
Launch confirmed. Even jammed, I can still take you guys on, right? This group is probably gonna be a higher priority. Nearly there. Every flight sim game seems to have like a jamming mission of this sort. Ace Combat definitely has loads of them. Targets in gun range. Enemy dead ahead. Enemy missile inbound. Jake Eagle, are you on the ground yet? Almost. Just a few more minutes. You said that a few minutes ago. Weapon launch. Right. Got that screw. I can't get a lock. Watch your tack map, Hawks Flight. Bandits are closing in on Eagle. Showing clean separation. Right, let's just get into this guy's circle and force him to come after us instead. This is Eagle, 20 miles out. Hang in there, guys. Tyler, get that guy at 9 o'clock. I can't reach him. Coming. Eagle, are you clear? We Watch can't keep this up much longer. Here. He's getting the range. Hawks Lead, this is Eagle. Be advised, we're almost on top of you. Splash that bandit before he detects us or we're going to be in trouble. It's still approaching. Break. Oh, that mission is hectic. I'm struggling to see what's going on. Target a 10 miles out. We're almost home free. Come on. <laughs> no way. 2%? No way. Finally. You're nearly there. Fox 2, Fox 2. Target is spiked. Fire at will. Target's destroyed. Hawks flight, this is Eagle. We're at the outer marker for November 4 and entering the base's defensive perimeter. We're home free. Hawks flight, this is Eagle. We're lining up for our final approach. Thanks for saving our skins. You guys are the best pilots I've ever seen. All in a day's work, Eagle. Glad to be of service. Although if the president wants to give us a medal, we won't say no. Yeah, I would like a medal. That would be lovely. Much obliged, Hawks. We're about to touch down now. Stand by. The president wants to talk to you. Gentlemen, I wanted to thank you personally for your courage and skill and your determination to see me and my family to safety. I will never forget what you've done today. And I promise you, the American people will hear about it too. Just doing our job, sir. No thanks necessary. Mr. President, what next? Where do we go from here? It's hard to say for sure, but I promise you, we're going to make Artemis pay for what they've done. Damn right. No, I'm surprised. I thought this game would be a lot shorter than what it is. I was very sure that the end of the game would be episode 10. FA18E, that's all we got. But yeah, looks like we got another mission. Iron Arrow. Ooh, nice. Okay, so that's that. Join me in episode 12 for Operation Iron Arrow. I'll see you guys then.